on air, online, on your side. You're watching KGUN 9 now. I don't know how these conditions affected drivers and caused damage around town. KGUN 9 News at 10 starts right now. On air, online, on your side. You're watching KGUN 9 News at 10. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Pat Paris. So let's get right to Kyler Diggs with more on today's sometimes wacky weather, sometimes dangerous weather as well, yeah, Kyler. No kidding. A lot of power lines down today. Lots of some minor damage, tree damage as well, all because of that storm system blowing across the region. Fortunately, the wind speeds have now substantially decreased across southeastern Arizona. Most of us seeing Wind speeds 5 to 15 miles an hour, so a great improvement there. But take a look at some of these peak wind gusts today across the region. Tucson International Airport, 51 miles an hour. I've got a little something to share with you on that here in just a second, but check that one out right there. Guthrie, 92 miles an hour. That's just a little bit south of Clifton there in Greenlee County. And then you move down the list, and we had several locations reporting wind gusts over 50 miles an hour. Now, your stories because you matter to us. You're watching Pat Paris and Heidi Alaga, KGA 9 on your side. Each month we spotlight a local nonprofit with our giving project, Doing Well by Doing Good. For the month of February, it's Bagot, a charity that helps those diagnosed with cancer navigate through that very difficult time. A Tucson-based nonprofit, Bagot, provides a bag to recently diagnosed cancer.